to build upon existing administration standards in governmental bodies. Ministry of Labour conducted a briefing session for IJADA program that is related to enhancement of institutional proficiency. Uh, the, the aim of this business, uh, excellence framework is that, that uh, we will, uh, that we, it will increase the, the level of governance and it will provide all government units with tools that will enhance their performance throughout the years. The program was delivered to participants that represented all civil governmental bodies, which will be using IJADA system. It aimed at delivery of His Majesty Sultan Haytham bin Tariq's wise directions about IJADA. It also shared main criteria of the key performance indicators, as well as the implementation plan and roles to be played and taken by the representatives. Uh, this project is part of the performance uh, individual performance uh, plan, uh, evaluation, uh, IJADA. Uh, this project has been initiated a long time ago and we believe that all government units already have the know-how and the capability to adapt and to apply those core principles of business excellence or of, of uh, government excellence uh, framework uh, toward uh, achieving uh, the, the objectives of this project. So basically we don't really think that there will be major challenges that cannot be superseded and we truly believe that this will be a massive driver to the improvement of uh, all government units across Oman inshallah. IJADA framework is targeted to be the system that will play a key role in performance governance to support and uplift workplace creativity and enhance positive competition between individuals. It's worth noting that IJADA system for institutional proficiency is aimed to start in the first quarter of 2023.